to Death Valley, Clemson, South Carolina. 80,000 plus gather for an ACC SEC matchup. Debo Sweeney's Clemson Tigers looking to end the nation's longest win streak, owned by Gene Chiswick and Auburn. Clemson is led by sophomore quarterback Taj Boyd. On the other side, a new QB for the defending champs. Barrett Trotter replaces Cam Newton. It's ESPN College Football presented by Buffalo Wild Wings. Auburn has won 17 straight, including a BCS championship, beat Clemson in overtime last year to springboard them to a title. On the other side, you've got Clemson led by Taj Boyd, a sophomore quarterback. They haven't been, they haven't won an ACC title in 20 years. Is Boyd the guy to get him there? Well, he can be the guy, and this is why. You have Dabo Sweeney and Chad Morris, the offensive coordinator, saying that he has to become a factor in the run. Right now, this offense is operating about a 50% capacity as far as execution. In order to get to the 80 to 90 to 100%, he's got to be a factor in the run. If he's a factor running the football, they're a threat. If he's not running the football, they're not a threat. It's that simple. Totally different offense. In fact, it is the same offense that Auburn runs, as opposed to the pro-style I formation we saw from Clemson last year. And Boyd will pull it back, and he'll find Allen. And he's across the 15, got about five on first down. This is as big a play for Taj Boyd as he's had in his young career. He has to get this first down to get Auburn offense, keep Auburn's offense off the field. That's for his confidence level. And for the team's confidence in Taj Boyd, that's why this play is so important to rest the Clemson defense. Pumps, gets hit, and delivers a strike for a first down. Out to the 40-yard line, it's Jerron Brown for 16 yards. Well, that's the patience right there. Taj Boyd using his eyes to create the receiver some room to get open. It's man-to-man -man coverage. Again, he uses his eyes with the pump, has a slant inside, and delivers a catchable ball. And Boyd on the keeper. I think it's pummeled at the 38-yard line. You see his numbers on today. By the way, Chris Davis, corner who started for Auburn, got dinged earlier, is back on the field. Third and five, Boyd, and open in the middle of the field is Watkins, and the true freshman picks up the first down and 12 yards. Now, Irvin, I think one of the man beaters is when you get bunch coverage, bunch wide receivers. All three guys are over to the right of your screen right there, tight together. What that does is set natural picks for the wide receivers to knock off the defensive backs. And again, Taj Boyd is growing up right now before our eyes. From inside the 30, Boyd to the air, going deep, and it's caught by Hopkins at the five. Brought out of bounds by Mincy. It'll be first and goal. Watch for tight end Dwayne Allen running option route, single coverage. Number 15 has a man-to-man. -man. And Boyd instead throws over the middle end zone, and it's caught. Touchdown, DeAndre Hopkins. Third and ten. And Boyd leveled, but he completes it anyway. And boy, what a shot. It's pulled in by Brown. Both the quarterback and receiver got drilled, and both popped to their feet. Great job by Taj Boyd hanging in there. That's a sign of toughness right there. It's a sign of toughness for a wide receiver when the quarterback throws you right in the middle of cover two with a safety. Defense checked out of the blitz after the offense checked out of its original play. Boy, downfield, leaping catch inside the 10 by Allen. It's first and goal from the seven. Boy has time. Back in the end zone. There's Allen. He's in. Touchdown, Clemson. Worked out that they, they still got seven yards out of the bus. Sure that worked out. Boyd on third and short, wide open as Watkins in the teeth of the defense. And he's to the 45, 13 yards. Okay. And a Clemson first down. Second and 10, pressure coming. And Boyd going down the sideline. What a grab inside the five by the spectacular tight end, Dwayne Allen. It's first and goal at the two. Well, you've seen a quarterback grow up. First year starter, Taj Boyd is making throw after throw, but the one thing, as Chris Spielman said in the first half, guys are making plays around him. Allen, the big tight end, NFL prospect, comes down with another great catch. Guys are making plays around him. This quarterback has grown up in the first half against Auburn. True freshman Mike Bellamy will start the game, or the second half rather, at running back, as Boyd will throw, and here's Watkins, who is very involved in the offense in the first half. And he picks up a first down here. Now it's up to Taj Boyd to recognize his zone, and every zone defense has a weakness in it. 
It's his job to find the weakness and throw it open. Third down and six. Boyd with time. And Watkins again. First down and more. A foot race. There goes Watkins. He'll take it all the way. Clemson lead. Touchdown. Boyd to throw, pop pass, Allen caught it, and has the first down to the 46th. Boyd on a quarterback draw, across midfield, dinged at the 48. Six straight successful conversions, and here's Boyd, and the pass is pulled in, and then at the end it comes out. Now it's ruled a catch. Boyd, and it's caught for a first down and more. Sharon Peak, another true freshman. Boyd on third and nine. Gets rid of it. Wide open. Watkins to the five. Touchdown, Clemson. Here's the blitz. First of all, good blitz click up by Taj Gordon, the offensive line. Sammy Watkins by a split alignment was going across the field. And how about Taj Boyd? Four touchdown passes in this game. He had six the first two games combined. Last year he played in seven games. The most he threw for in a game last year was 112 yards. He has 321 today. And Boyd will throw. And it's caught at the 28-yard line by Hopkins near the first down marker. And this is without the quarterback in the spread offense being a big run threat. On second and long, Boyd, and Allen goes up to make the grab. Knock off a defending national champ. Watkins in space, just shoves a teammate to create room, and he picks up another Clemson first down. Boyd with pressure gets nailed, and it is juggled and caught by Hopkins. What a play by the quarterback, and then Hopkins able to hang on to the ball. Boy took a lick. That's why I circled him before the play. Anytime they've been in press coverage, his number one option all day has been DeAndre Hopkins. A good job of staying with it, focus and concentration. Quarterback hung in there, a free, a free rusher. I have, I'll tell you what, I have not been more impressed with a quarterback in a long time to see his growth from game one oh, to game unbelievable. three. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. First down and inside two minutes to go. Boyd will keep. He's got running room. Near another first down at the 20 yard line. Auburn had a 17 game win streak, the longest in the country until now. The champs about to go down on the road. Fans will rush the field here in Death Valley. The fans will come on the field. Boyd takes a knee. Down go the champs. Auburn's 17 game win streak comes to an end. And I couldn't think of a better place to end the streak than Death Valley, South Carolina, baby. And a breakout game for Boyd. Almost 400 passing yards, four touchdowns.